the evacuation process. Legs! Legs, wait! Wait a minute! Go back inside! But where are you going? This doesn't concern you! Does this have something to do with the rebels? Do you know something? Just go back! How did she manage to escape? They knew we were coming for them. Someone on their team obviously knows computers. So what are we doing about it? Knocking on doors, setting up roadblocks, what? My guess is they've already left the city. This was a well-planned operation. If you hadn't acted when you did, Ram, that'd have buried us for sure. Mm, well, they still might. Java, I want you to find out everything you can about this Amber. I know this much already. She's a mall rat, like Ebony. <laughs> she what? That's not strictly true. Okay, she was a mole rat, once. She left them for this out-of-town nature lovers, uh, the eco-tribe. Seems like the ecos have been behind this from the start. Freeing Amber from the lab and staging this little performance. And how do you know all this? It's my job to know. Ved, I want you to see how much damage this has done us. So go and scout out the city and get the word on the street. Sure. And Ved, have you got any clues on whose code they used to break into our system? Uh, I'm working on it. Yeah, well, work a bit harder. All of you. Java, you can pay the mall rats a visit. Whatever you say, Ram. Where is it? Jay see that? He doesn't know a thing. So Jay knows everything? That you guys sprung Amber? That we interrupted their broadcast? The whole bit? Yes. Don't you think that's maybe a little dangerous? What's life without a little danger? It tends to last longer. Which I like. Patch, it was Amber's choice to take a chance on Jay. Right, and I'd say she's pretty smart. You know how I can tell? Because she's split, which is definitely the smart move. To be with her baby. Maybe you should split too, Patch. If you're so worried. I didn't say I was worried. Hey, Dee's right, Patch. You risked your neck to come help us. Now, if you wanted to leave, no one would blame you. But things could turn pretty nasty around here. They're just dead. Would somebody please tell me what's going on around here? Who are you? Uh, I'm mute by the looks of it. And where is Amber? Gone. Trudy, too. Back to the Ecos. Well, that's good for her sake. She made me look like an absolute fool out there. They cancelled the fight and everything. Why wasn't I told about this? You wonder why when all you're worried about is playing at gladiators? I have a duty to my public pride. You wouldn't understand. No, I don't. Anyway, what's all this about Ram being a great guy? Since when did Amber go over to their side? Lex, it wasn't Amber who said those things. The real broadcast was intercepted. That was a computer version of Amber who made that speech. Wow, really? She was supposed to badmouth the technos, not praise them. So why didn't she? Technical hitch. So you stuffed up. Well, I hope that teaches you all a valuable lesson. Next time, count me in. And maybe we can do the job right. You know what? This is bad. If Lex was fooled by what he saw, then everyone in the city will have been, right? I wouldn't be so sure about that. Come on, we've got work to do. Yeah. 
Java told Ram about Amber, that she was a mole rat. He'd have found out soon enough. You're not leaving. I don't know what else to do. Running away won't solve anything. Why don't you come with me? We could start again somewhere. No. I'm not running away again. It's like Amber said, the people have to know the truth. Ah. Amber. I thought you'd have something to say on the subject. Ebony, something bad is going to happen. I know it. Now we have to find out what Ram is planning. He won't talk to me, so it's up to you now. Why me? Because you're close to him. It's you I want to be close to. And you will be. We'll be together, I promise. You mean it? I guess I'll stay then. But there's still this business about Amber. What am I going to say to him? What was your tribe called again? Hmm? Your tribe? Oh, the Wrecking Crew. Where are you based? Sector 8. We're very big in that part of town. So how come I've never heard of the Wrecking Crew? You should get out more. Are you going back to them? I guess so. When I'm finished here. Why don't you join us? <laughs> really? Gotta hand it to those technos. We can do a big printing job like this without their power. So we use their own power to bring them down. Like judo. How's it look? Looks good. Yeah, nice going, guys. Hey, what about the discs? I burned a few. But it takes time. Thanks. Be careful. I will. It was good of you to see me. I always have time for you, Ebony. You know that. You spend a lot of time in reality space. Yeah, it's my private world. Only very special friends are allowed here. I assume you have an answer for me. Are you going to make me a happy ramp? I have my answer. But first, I wanted to explain about him. If you thought Amber and I were friends just because we were more ants together... Then I'd punish you. Right. The truth is, I hate Amber. She and I, we were always enemies. It was me who banished Amber from the city. She's my worst nightmare. You can ask anyone. I already did. That's how I know that you're pure. One of us. Will you be my bride, Ebony? <laughs> of course I'm flattered. Hey, don't say but. I, I don't want to hear a but. The thing is, there's someone else. A guy you made disappear. Bray. He's the one. I'm kind of promised to him, so thank you, but... Uh, I said no, no but! but. Ram, I... No! 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 I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Go! 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 Upset because of those people wired up to that machine. Yeah, I know. What was happening to them, Celine? Well, they're being treated very badly. 
But we're going to put a stop to that thanks to Sammy and the video he made. See, Sammy, you're a hero. I think he's putting it on. Mouse, can you go keep watch outside for a while? Shout if you see anybody coming towards the mall. Okay. Sammy, look at me. You'll soon forget what you saw. It might take a little while, but in the meantime, you don't have to say anything to anybody. Talk when you're ready to talk, okay? Hi. Oh, um, hi. I thought you had a fight tonight. Yeah, so did I. Well, never mind. We can have our date when we stay. Yeah, um, the truth is, I'm, I'm just not in the mood. Is it me? No. It's not that. Um, Ken. Ken. You promised. Do you want a drink or something? What I want, Mr. Gladiator Man, is to know whether all this tough guy stuff that I see on the screen is real or not. Some of the kids are saying it's all fake. Oh, no, it's not fake. It takes a lot of skill, I'm telling you. So prove it to me. Lex, are you a phony or are you the real thing? So what did they say? It's cool. What about the rest of your tribe? I mean, what are they going to say about it? What do you mean? Since my little brothers were taken by the technos, this is everyone. So I guess I'm a mall right now, huh? Or do I have to go through some kind of initiation rites? I think you've done enough to prove yourself already. <coughs> Mouse. Do you mind not doing that? The evidence? I took it all with me. You sure? Positive. He said he needed every single poster. We're in the clear. What's going on? Leave her alone. Where's the rest of them? Go search this place. There's nobody else here. You can't do this. You have no authority. As Deputy Sheriff... I Quiet! Sheriff or not, as a mall rat, you're under suspicion. Same as the rest of you. Suspicion of what? Acting to overthrow the technos. How? What are we supposed to have done? Found this kid, but there's no one else around. Bring him over here. The one who calls herself Amber, she's one of you. It was the mall rats who set her up to do a little speech on CityNet. I never met the woman. First time I saw Amber since she was banished was when she made that broadcast. We couldn't believe our eyes. You must have brainwashed her to make her say those things. I've heard enough. From you people, anyway. What about the kids? You know something, don't you? And I bet you never lie when it's really important. What's your name? Mouse. So, Mouse, why don't you tell me about Amber? She was here, wasn't she? <clears throat> you ever been on a roller coaster? I could fix one for you to try. It's just like the real thing. What about you? What's the matter with you, kid? Looks like you've seen a ghost. Why is he staring at you? 
I don't know. Um, I guess he likes me. Sam is just nervous, that's all. Um, he doesn't speak much. He must have been through some really bad experiences. Well, he's gonna go through a few more before I'm through. You hiding something from me? Uh, no, ma'am. Better not. Any of you, or you'll regret it. Come on, let's go. Don't think you've heard the last of this. It's okay, Sammy. Like you people said was gonna happen. Want to see Let's get beat this time. So did I, but we're rescheduling. Clear off, kid. You must think we're pretty stupid. That message you sent out from Amber? That was a trick. She'd never back up an outfit like the Technos. Trouble? Uh, it's nothing. How about you guys go and check out the casino? I'll catch you later. I need to talk to you. What about? The other night. Oh, that. It's okay, really. We were both pretty drunk. If anything, I took advantage of you. You're damn right. What do you mean? I know what you did, Chloe. Getting the code out of me so your friends could hack into the system? I thought we were friends. We are! Then why- I don't know anything about your stupid code! If you don't remember what we really did that night, then I guess you can't have enjoyed it after all. <laughs> Who does he think he is? Curse them and curse on all men. God? They are not worthy. Why not? He's created a world, hasn't he? All this because I refused to be his wife. Maybe you shouldn't have. I mean, if we're really going to beat him in his own game, we can't do that if he won't let us near him. You could live with that? If I belong to Ram? Sure. For about one second. I don't know, Ebony. When I first met him, he had real vision. A bit crazy, maybe. But I thought I could meet him halfway. This guy? You'll never know what he's thinking, no matter how close you get. How long is he gonna stay in there? I wish he'd stay in there forever. I wish... What is it? Nothing. Forget it. I can't watch you sit here. You're the only person that could have known. I don't give that code out to anyone. So tell Ram. Go ahead, tell him. And maybe you can explain to him how I got a hold of it. You're not even supposed to talk first, let alone give them the secret code. So you're a part of this rebel thing? I didn't say that. But if I am, then you are too, Ed. So you better make up your mind. Do you want to keep seeing me or would you rather be sticking up with Ram all day? Okay, let's see how tough you are without this gizmo. Leave him alone. But out, sister, this doesn't concern you. Concerns me, though. Give it back to him. Take it off me. You blast me with that thing, you're gonna be in a lot of trouble. Hand it over and we'll say no more about this. Come on. Quit while you're ahead. Catch you later, pal. A little misunderstanding. Where were you guys? It's okay, Ved. No need to thank me. Just doing my job.
What's happened? Ram is uh, up and about. No one is to go near the black room when I'm online. Is that understood? Yes, Ram. Did you have something to do with this? <laughs> Maybe. I want to know which of your men is responsible, and I want to know now. Ved, Java, Ram's been asking for you. How'd you get on? You're in the clear, Ebony, for now. But I'm watching you. Ben, what's the word on the street? Skip it. <laughs> oh, come on. Don't tell me you've got bad news, too. I would not want to be in your shoes. I'll, uh, see you later. I'll tell you one more time! Have you seen Lex around here today? It's been and gone, baby. Sammy saved us. Again? You're starting to make a habit out of this, Sammy. The slightest sound would have given us away, but he kept quiet. I kept quiet. That's because I wasn't scared. That's right, Mouse. You were very brave. Sammy, do you want a drink? Yes, please. <laughs> he talks. So, Patch, do you think we got away with it? They can't touch us. Good, because I need more posters. I think our little campaign's starting to work. I know it is. I hope I'm not interrupting. Have you left the technos? No, not officially. I think it's better if I stay on the inside, don't you? We're gonna work together, with you guys, to run Mr. Megabyte out of town. That's great news. Won't you be missed? I think Ram has other things on his mind at the moment. Lex, honey, are you there? Siva, what are you doing here? That's what I was going to ask you. What are you doing in bed? Are you ill, baby? Do you mind? No, I don't mind! Siva, wait, I can explain! <laughs> 